Hello and welcome to another video. This will be another product review video or just something that I wanted to show you or sort of recommend. And it is the United States National Park Service Passport um, Books. So basically this is a series of products that the National Park Service made um, with Eastern National beginning back in the 19... 80s I think. Um, I believe the first stamp collection was 1986. Um, and it's basically these little passport books. I have this, they have different versions. So the smallest one, um, which is not this one, I used to have, it's about this big. It's a little booklet and you can buy it for ten dollars at any national park that has a gift shop. And whenever you go around to different national parks you get a stamp um, in it. So there are other versions. There's another one that's a collector's edition, which is $25. It's larger. Um, that one you can't add extra pages if you run out of space. And then there's this one, which I bought for $55, which you're probably thinking is quite expensive for a thing like this. Um, but the thing is, is that it's almost like a donation to the National Park. Um, and if you're wondering, they did not sponsor this video or anything like that. I bought this with my own money and I'm giving you my own opinion on this. So if you open it up here, it's like a binder with, I don't even know how many rings, seven ring, seven rings. So you can add additional pages and there are different sections as you can see here. So if I want to show you a stamp, Go to the south. This is just the southeast section. So you can find the section that you are in. And here it has a list of all the parks in that region. It's also, if I could open it, has a map with detailed locations about where the parks are. And then, then you have what are the cancellation pages. So this is what you would get at a national park. You would get this stamp. Um, you can also buy these. These are the um, regional stamp collection. So every year they come out with a new one. So 2019, 2018, and I have a few other years. And that's just something that you can collect um, as well. There will also, in each section, be park descriptions. So most people could probably find this online, but it gives you like the phone numbers for each of the parks in that region. It's quite a lot, not too many pages though. And it tells you the phone number, the website, a little bit about each of them. And that's for each of the nine sections of the parks, nine park service little sections. Well, sort of regions of the parks. It also comes with this little pouch at the back, which if I unzip, you can put you can put anything that you want in here. It comes with a National Park Service map. Definitely not gonna unfold it because that would be quite difficult to refold again. It does have a few more pouches and pockets. Oh, and another thing includes a spot if you wanted if you have like a pass or something for the national parks like a parking pass or something like that includes another pocket with these stickers that I got from the stamp collection and it also includes it's very nice passports your national parks explore edition pen which is a decently high quality pen I would say not something that you would normally get for free but this kit was definitely not free um, you can also, since it's a binder, you can open it up and you can add additional pages. Um, you do have to buy the pages for them from them, uh, but they're not too expensive if you fill them if you fill up the, all the pages, which I hope I do. Since getting this is an incentive almost for you to go visit more national parks, to get more exercise by walking in them and just to explore our country. So this is a great 
um, way to like almost tell yourself that it's time for you to go exploring in different places. Um, so near me, I have like at least 12 national parks that I can visit, and I've already visited some. I already had that little booklet, and I already filled it up, and I did lose it sadly. We went on a big trip about like a year and a half ago um, down to Phoenix, Arizona, and over to the Grand Canyon, and Bryce National Park, and all, there are lots of national parks over there. So we actually bought the smaller version of that, of this, and we filled it up with a lot of stamps. Sadly, we lost that. That's also a reason why you can get this one, is it also comes with a carrying thing. And this is not an advertisement for this. I'm just recommending that you get it if you like exploring or visiting national parks, stuff like that. If you're wondering, that noise is just my computer charger falling on the ground. So I hope that if you get this, that you enjoy it just like I do. Um, and thank you for watching, and have a great day. And you can always subscribe below.